training began in New Zealand over a hundred years ago, and our mission is to empower girls to change their world. We do this by running different programs, activities, and events for girls aged between five and 17. In New Zealand, that is primary through to high school ages. And in guiding, that is Pippins, Brownies, Guides, and Rangers. All of our programs and activities are aimed at growing our girls' confidence, teaching them real life skills, and increasing their leadership potential. You may be someone who's interested in working with children, or you want to empower young girls, or maybe you're just looking for something to do in your local community. You don't need any special skills to be able to volunteer with us. Our volunteers come from all different places, ages and stages. And everything you need to know, we will teach you or you will be mentored in. We have amazing leaders and we're looking for new volunteers who are interested in joining us and growing guiding in their local communities. We have thousands of volunteers who work with Girl Guiding across New Zealand and the most common role that people do is being a unit leader. There are hundreds of units across New Zealand and there is usually one close to you depending on where you live. Each guiding unit runs once a week in the afternoon during the school terms for between one or two hours. As a unit leader you will join an existing team of volunteers to help prepare a term plan and lead the goals every week. Training is provided and all unit leaders are required to do a mix of online and in-person trainings. We will support you to develop the relevant leadership skills and ensure you have a great volunteering experience. To be a good volunteer, all you need to do is be reliable and committed to your role. Joining a unit is a regular and hopefully a long-term commitment. If you aren't able to do something every week or you want something to fit into your schedule, we also have a more flexible volunteering option called Girl Powered. Girl Powered is a series of events that run in Auckland, Wellington and Christchurch. We are also looking to expand this into other regions. The Girl Powered events run for four to five hours in the morning or in the afternoon on the weekends. You can choose to go to one or both of them. Things you'll be doing include running games, doing experiments and hands-on activities. Events we have run this year include Edible Science, Robot Warriors, Lost in Space, Camp Curiosity and STEM in the Park. At a Girl Powered event you'll turn up on the day and the leader will help you get involved in the activities and guide you in how to best support the girls. Don't worry, you won't be alone, there will be other volunteers as well. The role is flexible, you don't have to go to every single event but you can choose the ones that you find interesting. We also have other flexible volunteering options such as managing our girl guide properties or being a local coordinator for units in your area. Or you can join our flexible volunteer team if you've got skills that you'd like to share with the girls but can't commit to a more regular volunteering role. So in my role as a local coordinator, I don't run a unit but I do support the leaders who are running their own units and helping them through their journey so they can provide the best experience for our girls. We also have an online correspondence version of Girl Guides called Explore, which you may be interested in doing if you want to support girls in an online environment. All of our volunteers are required to do a police feeding check and also a reference check. These are really simple processes and your local volunteer recruiter will work through this with you. If you choose to be a unit leader, you will also be asked to complete an online training and to visit a local unit so that you can fully understand what being a Girl Guide leader is all about. The best part of being a unit team leader is that I can see the girls grow and become better versions of themselves. Previously, I never really worked with children, so it was a very new experience for me and I thought that I'll leave it in an era or so, but I've been doing it for the past three years and I'm loving it. I'm a volunteer because I really enjoyed my time as a girl guide and I want to give back so that girls can have the same awesome experience I did. When I first signed up, I wasn't too sure if I was the right fit for guiding, if I had the right skill sets or the right kind of personality to deal with a bunch of young girls. But once I started working with them and realised how much fun it was and how much energy the girls bring, I realised that it was definitely the best thing I'd done. Absolutely no regrets. If any of these roles seem like something that you can see yourself doing, I really encourage you to get in touch with the team at Girl Guiding, either through your local recruitment coordinator or you can check out our website. And I hope to see you soon.